What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Joe 93 and I'm back with some more Pokemon Ultra Sun Nuzlocke. Training with you guys, we are now in part three. And in the last part, part two, I cleared out, I guess, Route 1? I'm not sure if there's still more to explore. I defeated some trainers, got some items, got some money, and I caught my newest member on the team. We got Flick, the male Grubbin. He's at level 5. I caught him at level 4 on Route 1, because... Route 1 is 100% catch rate at the beginning only. So right now, I don't think it is. Just that one time. So if I would have studied that grass, I could have just caught everything, you know? I believe it was in the original games as well. So I hope everyone is having a happy and healthy, wonderful day slash night. Whenever and wherever you're watching this video on stream, you're all staying safe. So now we are on part 3. We got to make our way to Iki Town for the festival, of course. I'm at zero badges, zero deaths. The level cap is at level 12. For the totem Pokemon and a level 16 for the Island Kahuna. Their ace Pokemon. On my first attempt. So I'm going to give you guys a quick team recap of course. Of my beautiful sex looking team that I got going on over here for you guys. First up we have my newest member on the team. We have Flick. The male Grubbin at level 5 from A Bug's Life. One of my favorite movies as a kid growing up. Rockin' moves Vice Grip and String Shot. Pure Bug type with Swarm as his ability. Quiet Nature. And his characteristic is capable of taking hits. And last, but starting at least, we have my starter Pokemon. We have Garfield the Male Litten at level 8. Pure Fire type with Blaze as his ability. Rockin' moves Scratch, Ember, Growl, and Lick. Sassy Nature with very funky characteristic. So, let's keep going. Shall we? Oh, a lone Exeggutor! Grass Dragon type. Who would have thought? How friendly everyone is. There's the island Kahuna. Hala. The Alola region. The Alola region made up of four regions. And each island has its own guardian Pokemon. Our festival today is to give thanks to our guardian deities. The seven deities. Broken Hardies. Shout out to Matt Hardy and shout out to Jeff Hardy. One of my favorite tag teams of all time. One of the greatest taxis of all time as well. Cannot forget that. We bow this man now. Uh, let me see the rival battles for this young man. Uh, give me one minute. No, not Sun and Moon. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. Thank you. My boy, how? There he is. Alright. Shouldn't be difficult. How's my special defense looking like? Alright, we're pretty good. And my defense, we're good. Oh, how's it, Joey? Man, I thought you'd never make it. Me and my rallet has been waiting for ages. <laughs> Hold on, did anyone explain to you about tonight? A full-powered festival for Pokemon battling. We battle in the name of Tapu Koko, pitting our best moves against one another in a friendly competition to please our guardian. Woo! Yes! Free heal, baby. Am I ready? Say less. I'm ready for carnage. Then let's begin. Alright, here we go. Hala. For all life on our islands. And for those who undertake the island challenge. With joy in their hearts. We pray for your protection. For them and all of Mele Mele. May this Pokemon battle be an offering to our island's guardian deity, Tapu Koko. Before you stand, before you stand, how? Grandson to the Kahuna. Let's have fun with this Rowlet. Before him stands Joey, one who has met with Tapu Koko. What? What a curious little thing Tapu Koko is, huh? 
That's just typical of it. Grubbin, take care of my little Joey. As long as we both have a good time, then I think we can call it a great battle, eh? Eh, where's Gabe, huh? Joey, how? Bring forth the power of your Pokemon. Alright, Rival Battle 2 against my boy, how? In Melimeli Island. At Iki Town. Again. He has a team of two this time. And he starts battle off with a Pichu, his newly caught Pichu at level 6. Pure Electric type with Static as his ability. So if you inflict physical damage, 30% chance you will get paralyzed. We should outspeed it. Psych? Oh, Charm? Oh my gosh, that's minus two. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a crit. Oh, Static, of course. Oh, we gotta swap. We're not playing any games. I just want the experience. Oh, Charm again? That's a very good move to have at the beginning of a game. Woo! Minus two? I think I have Ember. Alright, Pichu was defeated one down, one more to go. Yeah, your lower level Pokemon will get more experience. They did that since Gen 5. Next up is Rowlet. His starter Pokemon at level 7. Grass Flying type. With Overgrow as its ability. See how it tells you, super effective. Leafage, that's fine, we eat that up. That was a crit? Was that a crit? Let's go! Alright, Rowlet was defeated, two down, no more to go. Damn, he didn't want experience? If you press the Y button to care, you will care right after the battle. Garfield goes to level 9, nice too. I defeated Pokemon Trainer, how? In Rival Battle 2. At Iki Town. What? It's over already? 140 Poké Dollars for winning. That's it. This man has no money for me. Oh, we have to heal Grubbin over here. Uh, which one is it? I forgot. Is it this one? Don't worry, Flick. Look at that. I don't have to waste items. This game just feeds you everything, you know? Alright. Saved me a Paralyzed Heal, you know what I mean? Oh, when I get max friendship, it's a wrap. You can dodge moves, you get 1.5 extra experience, so say you have like a permanent lucky egg. Oh, uh, you can heal yourself of status conditions. Mad helpful, mad helpful. All right, we're good, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, another great battle this year. I bet Tapu Koko liked it, too. Oof, that was awesome, Joey. That was a really great battle. I had a blast fighting you. Yeah, I got a crit turn one. And I got paralyzed turn one. It was a good battle. With this, even Tapu Koko. Koko, Koko, Koko. Oh, you heard it yourself, Tapu Koko. Song of approval. Uh-oh. We got the Z power ring on our wrist. We slipped it, you know? Slipped it on. Your Z power ring, a mysterious armband that can draw out the power that lies deep within Pokemon. You can bring forth their Z power. Oh, we have the Z moves. Oh no, I forgot. The island challenge. Four islands. You'll travel to each of the four islands here in the Alola region. The island challenge is about aiming to be the strongest trainer. The island challenge champion. Woo! Sounds like a real event you already know. Oh, so once you're 11 years old, you can start on a journey. All right. Supposed to be 10, but I guess this game or this generation, they have to wait next year. What I get? What I get? What I get? Say less. Oh, 
Oh, that's like, um... It's just like something to have to indicate your, that you're in the island challenge. And me too, I want to see Tapu Coco. Yeah, fun fact, my Uncle Peter actually calls me Coco. So, Tapu Coco, it's like they knew it's, that's Pokemon for me, you know? That was a mysterious... That was a most mysterious event. A festival to celebrate Drawing's fourth one's full power? You look like you were enjoying the show. Did you take part in these battles too? Or did you want to take part in them? Don't be silly. We have to investigate and learn. Even without technology, we cannot control the blinded one's light. Thus, we are left with no choice but to try to stop it by force. And yeah, it seems that the humans of this Alola can wield powerful ores. Yeah, what they call it, uh, a, a Z power ring? It's Orion's went off the chart. You think that's why they can control ores like that? Alola is definitely an amazing place. Let's go check out the next site. I don't know what these clowns want. But I don't want part of it. Honey, I'm home. I forgot who says that. Ah, it's free, hill, baby. The next day. Yeah, alright, good. So whatever... Alright, so they kept the time of day. Of course, I started in Generation 2. The Johto region. Where's my... Uh, it's supposed to be a trash can in every game. It's not here? There it is. No, you can't talk to it. There's Meowth's bed. I have to go to Professor Kukui's lab. Here, a little pocket money. She already gave me 5,000! What's next? Alright, I had like... What, I have 50... 54, 68 or something like that? Plus what uh, Hao gave me? Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Meowth, for the good luck. We're gonna become the Pokemon Champion and complete this Nuzlocke before Dominant Pro come out. Oh, gosh. Here we go. I know she gives a lot. Oh, my gosh. 30,000 free of charge. Free of charge for an 11-year-old kid. <laughs> Say less. I know there's an item here, man. I know there is. Just give it to me. It's like a, I know it's like a potion or something, but it's still a free item. I don't remember what the item finder is in this game. I forgot. Alright, I don't know where it's at. What? Oh yeah, I gotta go this way. Was this another encounter? Oh, Repel keeps po wild Pokemon away, of course. And if you have Lores, which is, um... Let's go Pikachu and Eve, you, are, you attract more Pokemon. Oh, the ledges, of course. Look at this, Doug. I don't know what route this is. Damn it, still route one. Well, no new encounters for me. Shit. Let's go, kneecaps.
Youngster Kevin. Inkay. Dark Psyche type. With a uh, contrary as ability, right? I think. If you lower its stats, it, its special attack sharply raises, I think. Something like that. Level 6? Gosh. Reflect this early? That's mad good. That does nothing. I gotta go into Garfield. Poké dolls aren't the same currency as US dollars. It's a lot less. Wow. Still, it's a lot. Peck. Oh, it had Peck. Good thing I swapped. Sorry, assassin. Oh, the crit. Constrict. Fine. Alright, NK was defeated. Flick was level 6, nice too. For youngster Kevin. Ah, brought to my knees. 120 Pokedolls for winning. Why is he all dirty? That's not it. Uh. Don't worry, Assassin, when we get max friendship, you'll see why I'm doing this. Also, depend on how fast they eat determines if they're hungry or not. Ah, uh, what the hell? I gotta catch my Pokemon. Pokemon with cool knees are so neat. <laughs> this guy's a clown. Shit, I want that item. On Awakening, alright, nice too. Of course, Paralyze heal, heals Paralysis, Awakening is to heal Asleep. You have Anadol for Poison, Burn Heal for Burned, Ice Heal for Frozen. You have Berries for Confusion, also for all status as well. Alola, check out my cool Pokemon. Last Madison. What do you got for us? Youngos. Level six? I'm swapping. Leer? That's not good. Oh, double Leer? <laughs> Get the thing out of here. It's deadly. Alright, Young Ghost was defeated. Garfield goes level 10. Nice Sue. Black goes level 7. Double Nice Sue. Ooh, Mud Slap. Triple Nice Sue. You learned Mud Slap. Defeated last. Madison. Ah, oh, you're kind of strong, aren't you? Yep, I am. 144 Pokedolls winning. If you see a Pokemon trainer, you gotta show off the Pokemon you like. You're not wrong. Trainer tips. The Pokemon that will appear first in a battle will be the one that you've put in the top left position in your Pokemon list. In an item? Nothing? Oh, damn. The trainer there. Maybe not a trainer. We can't go here yet, can we? No, we can't. I 
Oh no, I was afraid of this! Wingles are very deadly if you have Litten. Growl. Damn it. Water gun, that's fine. Growl. That's fine, I guess. Don't do it again. Ah, I did it again. Of course. Alright, keep spamming Growl. Get out of here. Ten Carrot Hill. Pokemon I got with me are all grass type. I'm looking for some water type Pokemon for my team so I can be fire types too. Alright, you do that. Pokemon Research Lab, we miss anything here? Oh, Murkrow. Oh, it's nighttime. Oh, that would have been. Oh, that'd be a powerful encounter. That's a water type trainer? That's not good. The calm sea or the stormy sea, which you prefer? Ah, it depends how I'm feeling. Depends on my mood. Swimmer Natasha. Ah, oh, damn it. Here comes Wingo. Go flick. Level 7? Yo, it's not good for me, fam. Play that right now. Water gun? Alright. A crit is 1.5. Damn, it's not double. That was only generation 1, 2, 4. Supersonic miss. Nice, too. Stone go for growl. And it goes for growl! Come on, flick. Ooh, what's damage? Supersonic, we dodging, baby! We dodging! That wingo was defeated. Get out of here. 76 experience? I had to face one Natasha. I guess I prefer calm, at least for my opponents. 168 Poké Dollars for winning. Pretty sure they're not hungry yet. Yeah, we're good. Once I get that max friendship, it's a wrap. Oh! Oh, did he went up? I think I think he's at two hearts now. Let's go, baby! I forgot what the hearts give. I'm gonna Google that right now, actually. Just give me a minute. Uh Pokemon Ultra Sun Hearts? Affection guide. There we go. Is that what I want to know? Shit, I want to know what it does. Like, what does it give? Uh. Alright, here we go. Having... Hearts are a great indicator of how happy a Pokemon is and will help you quite a bit in battle. Two hearts increase the experience you gain by a multiplier of 1.2. Three hearts. Hearts will make your Pokemon have one HP in a situation where it would usually faint. Oh! <laughs> That's mad good. Four hearts. Hearts will make your Pokemon evade attacks and heal status effects after a turn. Oh, so that's not five hearts. Five hearts will increase the chance of you landing a critical strike. That's mad good. As opposed to affection, friendship or happiness is also a feature with Pichu and Munchlax once the gauge reaches a required level. Yo, that's mad good. That's mad good, fam. Yo, Penguin, welcome back to the stream, my guy. I hope you're having a happy and wonderful night and safe. I like to see in all in any of its moods. It's always like the same motion after all. I know this item somewhere, fam. Give my item. Dude, I want that Murkrow. Give me that. 
I'm in the party after this. The professor. Yeah, he's a thug, I know. You don't gotta tell me twice. Snubble and a Stuffle. And a Rock Ruff. And a Corsola. And a Love Disc. Is Lily your rival? Nah, she's just like, uh, she's Professor Kukui's assistant. Your rival is Hal in this game. We get the Rotom decks. Really? Rotom? Oh, the Rotom deck. And he talks. Why is Professor shirtless? Because they're in Hawaii. And he wants to show off. Rotom. He just came out of nowhere. He's trying to flex. I know, right? Oh, there he is. Rotom Dex, baby. That's my boy. Oh, hi there. Ple pleasure to meet you. I I I'm not nervous or anything, okay? Thank you very much, Professor Kokui. What's going on here? Oh, there's Hal. There's my rival. Alola. That's how you greet everyone in this game, you know? We go to the trainer school. Save that for the next part. The Island Challenge. We we'll have a little poke around. Oh man. The Alola region. Alright, so we gotta go to the trainer school. Going this way. Can I talk to anyone here? Well, Poliwhirl. Oh, it's gonna evolve into a Poliwrapped. Cause you know, water fighting type and it's a punching bag. I got it, I got it. Some high tech stuff. Alright, so... Everything has fallen into darkness. The Lunar Eclipse. It's a good omen. All the Z crystals. Oh man. Everything went all black of a sudden. I thought it might be out of batteries. I know, right? <laughs> At least the professor thinks it's a good sign, huh? Let's hope he's right.
I'm trying to get out of this grass. Oh! Slowpoke! Wait, every time I get into a Pokemon, I forgot Rotom does that, I'm good. Level 7. Hey, level 7? Oh, I didn't heal! Oh, Dana does nothing. Oh, curse? Oh, no, 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 no. We're not playing that game. You lower your speed by one, but you raise your attack and defense by one. Uh-uh. Count me out. Get a free heal, you know? Almost died. I would have been upset, mate. That thing was trying to set up on me. Oh, we got a free Pokeball. Thank you, Mom. Me out. Okay. Alright, I'm in the part right here. Alright. I have to keep track of everything. Alright. So, let me give you guys a quick team recap, of course. Of my beautiful Sysoka team that I got going on over here for you guys. I actually have to, uh... Take pictures, I don't forget. Of what parts I'm on. Alright. Let me give you guys a quick team recap of my beautiful sex like team that I got going over here for you guys. First up, we have Flick, the male Grubbin, at level 7. Pure bug type, with Swarm as his ability, and he just learned Mudslap. Quiet nature and characteristic, capable of taking hits. Rocking moves Vice Grip, String Shot, and Mudslap. And last, but certainly least, we have my starter Pokemon. We have Garfield, the male Litten, at level 10. Pure fire type. With Blaze as his ability, Rock Move, Scratch, Ember, Growl, and Lick. Sassy Nature, and Very Finky as his characteristic. So in today's part, I just did the Professor tutorial. With Lily, I got myself a Rotom Dex. Mom gave me an extra Pokeball and uh, defeated some trainers. I uh, got some items. I also got the Z-Power Ring. And I defeated Hal in Rival Battle 2? At the festival? Yeah. Alright. So, this video and commentary is coming to an end. This is Jojo93. This has been part 3. I'm gonna let's play a Pokemon Ultra Sun Nuzlocke journey with you guys. Thank you, Assassin and Penguin, for stopping by. And... Anything... I forgot to mention, I will put in the description below. I'm gonna take a break now. But, uh, thank you guys for watching. Anything I forgot to mention, I will put in the description below. And stay tuned for part four. Where we have to go to the trainer school and go to the next area, I believe, which is Route 2. So we have a lot to do in the next part. And I will catch you guys next time. I'm also at zero badges, zero deaths. The level cap is at level 12 for the Totem Pokemon and level 16 for the Island Kahuna. On my first attempt. And I will catch you guys next time.